Hi, thanks for sending the uh, the printer over. I've got it now. Um, I just wanted to just mention a few things whilst when setting the printer up. Um, firstly, when you've obviously got your roll of satin here in the middle, um, just try and make sure this is tight as possible. I noticed that if you just look underneath here, there's a little little winder there that wasn't that wasn't uh, wound tight enough, so the label was moving around a little bit in there. Um, next, when you're putting your ribbon on onto the spool on the bottom here, it's obviously got to be in the centre because it's got to match the position of the satin material underneath it. Okay, uh, and just on the top here, although it works, uh, it is actually better to use obviously this spool. You, there should be another spool that came with the printer that you would put here. And then rather than using a small core, you'd use a larger core like that that you could put there as well for it to wind onto. But for the purposes of what I'm trying to do here, I just want to try and show you, um, obviously, we'll get the printer to, I'll just pop my phone down there a moment. So I'm going to attach this to the top spool, wind it in. Okay, so as you can see now, as we go, as we shut the printer down, the black material, the black ribbon, I should say, is perfectly onto the there. Okay. Another thing I noticed on here, it, it was um, it kept saying something about country code not selected, so I cleared that error. Um, just okay. So if we go with the barcode label to start with, this is just printing onto the satin material. Um, I've gone with the slowest speed, which is either two inches per second or 50 millimeters per second. And I've just put the darkness for 25 for the moment. Although I did say it's not the, the greatest to sort of print the ladder form style of barcode, it actually is printing out quite neatly. So if we just run a, a few labels here, and the satin, you see it coming out. Printing out okay on the satin, and then there you are. That's pretty good um, for uh, for ladder form barcode printing that way around. Okay, and then if we just swap over to the other label, which I've actually redesigned this within the software uh, rather than used your PDF. Again, just to try and get the best, uh, just get a better quality of print. The little black and white um, Union Jack's not great, but uh, it, it's. I'm just trying to obviously show you for the purposes of, of how to how to do this. Um, so. If, uh, if we go to print here, again, I've gone for the slowest speed. This darkness, I've gone for 27. Let's just print a few of these out for you. See, quality of that is pretty decent for what you're trying to achieve there. Okay, I think for the moment then that's okay, and uh, we can then, if, well, once you've had a look at this video, then we can sort of have a chat on the phone and uh, take it from take it from there. Okay, thank you.